How does it feel to come here, not as a tourist, but now really for, as a player for the country's uh, champions and EuroLeague uh, finalists? It feels great. Um, I got a really warm welcome at the airport. Uh, I got a chance to, to come out here with my family, and I think it's going to be a great life experience for me to be able to play uh, professionally at a very high level for an organization that's committed to winning. Um, and I'm just here to, to do whatever I can to help. You know, whatever the staff and management ask of me, that's my responsibility for the time I'm here. I can't control the other stuff that, that goes on with the lockout in the NBA. But um, I'm committed to this team, the coaching staff, the organization, uh, for my time here. And I just want to do my part to, to help us grow and, and continue on those winning ways. Excited about the sport, excited about me being here. Um, as much as, you know, I'm, I'm just as excited as they are. Uh, I really thought this opportunity was a good one for myself and my family. And I couldn't wait to come. I had a, 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 little, a wedding to go to in, in L.A. or else I would have come a few days earlier. But I was, I was looking forward to getting on the plane and getting out here and to, to get that warm reception when I landed. was was pretty special. Uh, first off, the style of play, I think it will fit me very well. Uh, I've been taught to play basketball the right way. And, you know, respect the game and always make the right play in front of you and that's all I'll do you know my skill set will allow me to play in any system for any style of coach I played for Phil Jackson who doesn't need a point guard and then I got a chance to go to the Nets where I had to be the lead guard and control the team uh, so I'm not really too concerned about adjusting to the style of play you know I just fit in with with the teammates and, and see what the staff asks me and in terms of leaving during the middle of the season it's, it's not something I'm looking forward to you know I'm sure I'm going to be close with all the guys the team, make new friends and, and close people out here that I'm not going to want to leave um, but there's a business aspect to it too and part of my contract says once once the NBA figures it out I have to go back and um, I think they've done a great job putting other people in place to to pick up the slack who are very capable of keeping this organization going in the, in the right direction if I'm here or if I'm not Jordan, what do you think about what's happening this summer with a lot of NBA players coming to play in Europe? What do you think is going to do to the EuroLeague, to the European uh, domestic leagues? Uh, I don't think too many EuroLeague teams are, are going to sign a lot of players who have the opt-out clause to go back. But this is what we do for a living. This is our job. And for the time being, we can't, we can't work. There's no, there's no place for us to go play other than to come over here. And I understand, you know, the feeling of a lot of the guys, and I understand the position of a lot of the teams, you know, really not being too sure about it. So I think my situation is unique, being such a good fit, being that, you know, my background and wanting to be a part of this organization, uh, it just worked out. But I don't think there's going to be too many opportunities um, out there, especially on the better teams and the EuroLeague teams, um, for guys to come out and play. I understand my situation is unique, so I'm not here to, to ruffle any feathers. I'm here to be a positive influence any way I can. Um, I'm a leader by nature, and whether I'm on the floor or not, you know, I think it'll you know, get transcended every day in practice and just being around everybody and just having that winning attitude and winning mentality. Um, but I'm not here to, to show anybody up. Or to, you know, I'm just trying to be a member of the team, a positive influence, and whatever they ask me is what I'll do. Right now, I have a contract back in America that I have to go back to. It's the situation with all this stuff, but... There will come a time in the actual very near future that I'll be a free agent there and I can go play wherever I want. And I think this will be a great step in just testing the waters and seeing how it works out for everybody involved. And I'm definitely not opposed to it. I like to see all my options that are out there. And, you know, I feel very welcome to feel part of this family right now. So I think it's definitely a step in the right direction. Last year, Maccabi Tel Aviv made it to, do, to the European uh, final against Panathinaikos. Do you think now that you're here, they can do with you one step forward? This I hope season. so. I hope so. I mean, that's what I'm here for. And I try to win every time I step on the floor. Uh, hopefully, I'm here long enough that I can be a part of it till the end. But if not, I wish them the best. And I think that our experience together will, will help the team grow in hopefully a positive direction.